Hey, what's the video? This is my friend back to land. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can boot your CM14 in a Samsung Galaxy J7. And finally, we have the Android Nougat 7. So here we have the file. The file size I'm going to show you that the file size is around only 300 MB. So I have provided the links in the description. You can easily download. But before starting, I want to tell you that this is only a testing version. It has some major bugs like Wi-Fi, camera, and Bluetooth. Your SIM card is not detecting. And the reset problem is still there as we are getting in our CM13. But if you want to get a one-time experience for till now in your Samsung Galaxy J7, you can install this. And if you want a stable version, I don't have that right now. So you can skip this video, otherwise you can continue. So without any further ado, let's get started. <music> always we gonna boot in our recovery mode now from here first create a backup it is very necessary otherwise if you don't like same 14 you can go back to your previous one easily so just click on backup and click on boot data system EFS radio and set your storage like micro SD card and it is mandatory so just swipe to backup I'm just skipping that part so here the backup has been created so now we can successfully install cm14 as j7 so just go to wipe advanced swipe and we wipe system data cache delivery cache and just swipe to wipe and now just go back and go to install and sorry for the file where you have stored it i have my file in my internal sd so here we have this cm j7 so just swipe to confirm flash it will take around five minutes to install so i am just skipping that part so it has successfully installed so just click on reboot system first no need to wipe cache or delivery cache just reboot system. and guys don't try to copy this video in a youtube or any other platform because this is not the official cm14 by xd developers this is the text testing version till now so don't try to copy it otherwise i will block that person and it has some bugs so it, i cannot recommend you to use it for day-to-day -day purpose so here you can see that the CM14 is now booting and the best part is you don't need to have a dual boot your touch base and CM14 together and it will take a lot of time and it will take around more than 2 minutes less than sorry 2 minutes to complete the boot so I am just fast forwarding the video So here you can see that I am getting a pop up after booting that your settings has stopped. Open app again so I just clicked it and it is just lagging a lot. This is the most common bug of CM14 for now in a Samsung Galaxy J7. So here you can see that it is not showing any Wi-Fi network. So I am just skipping it. Not detecting any SIM. I have two SIMs installed. I don't know why it is not detecting. But developers are really hard working on that and we will soon get a CM14 stable version for our J7 and I also know that many of you are really hoping that when we will get a stable Sanjin 14 or Android Nougat so here you can see that the new status bar so here it is first showing that around 0% battery now it is showing 34% there are many bugs so here we have the new status bar no new apps are installed in this because it is lagging a lot you can see let me lower the brightness so here we have the new settings menu here you can see that the Wi-Fi is still not working the Bluetooth and we have this new settings menu it is really interesting but I cannot recommend you to use it for day to day purpose so here in memory you can see that we have around 800 MB available of 1.3 GB it is really lagging a lot so you cannot use so here it is not detecting any same no wi-fi networks and you can also edit these toggles like track to add titles we have the new show layout bounce force gpu rendering so guys this is a quick video with which you can easily get a one-time experience of cm14 for now in your samsung Galaxy g7 i hope you really enjoyed this video and if you did a like will be appreciated and for more videos like this you can subscribe to my youtube channel by clicking on the subscribe button down below 
but before ending i want to tell you that i will soon going to come up with the new giveaways and new unboxing because we our channel has just crossed 2500 subscribers and i really really want to thank you all of them and i will soon starting unboxing new phones so stay tuned with my channel i am really busy right now because i just get a job in youtube so it will take around less than one month to get myself set up so stay tuned with my channel so that's all with this i'll see you in the next video thank you